Good evening. An unprecedented announcement from Calgary Police tonight. Investigators believe they've finally busted open the deadly gang war that terrorized the city five years ago. They have just charged five people with six murders. The targeted killings date back to the height of the gang rivalry. Many of the accused are familiar names and the murders very high profile. The News Hour's Gary Bobrovitz joins us now. Gary, this is a stunning development. Yeah, Dallas Gord, all five are known to police as gang members, and some have a very long history of violence. One is still on the run tonight. That man is Timothy Chan. He's charged with first-degree murder in a drive-by shooting in northeast Calgary five years ago. Police cannot locate him. All of these murders made news headlines. One, the infamous Bolso restaurant triple murder. Two men and an innocent bystander were gunned down. Four people had been charged before, and now you can add two others, Nicholas Chan and Dustin Darby. One of the most high-profile Calgary gang members is Nathan Zuccarato. He now faces two additional charges of first-degree murder in another shooting at a Northeast Calgary restaurant. He was already convicted of first-degree murder in the Bolsa case and is appealing. Both Dustin Darby and Nicholas Chan are facing new first-degree murder charges in the Bolsa case. Now, Calgary police say they use the resources of, of more than a dozen law enforcement agencies across Canada. They say these are complex and lengthy investigations, and the cost could be in the millions of dollars. The investigation was called Operation Decino. Gord, Dallas. Thanks, Gary.